yeah, it was, it was, it's, it's special. You know, you go down there. One, you're obviously a team. You're bound together from different countries. You're, you, you appreciate each other when you play against each other. But uh, it's a different, different scenario when you're playing with each other. And likewise, the, the crowd, the supporters, it's all singing different songs. We we're talking about it earlier. You know, they're singing Irish songs, singing Welsh songs, singing, you know, Scottish and English songs, and. Um, you know, all the one crowd. So it is, it's a special time and, and uh, I think people really relish that. Oh look, I think the, the Lions is synonymous with rugby. I think, you know, everyone, everyone knows it and everyone uh, aspires to, to, as a player, to, you know, to, to try and play for them. But, you know, as a supporter, it's, it's, it's kind of a pinnacle as well. And in terms of having been able to have something on your, on your club gear that, that kind of can show that you're contributing to, to what this you know, fantastic uh, organisation is and it's a fantastic thing to, to behold. Yeah, 2001, <clears throat> I got called up late, um, so it got the last three weeks and uh, it was just, it was, it was very strange for me because I, I was still quite young. Like said, Dalalu coming up to me and you know, having chats with me, he was, I was replacing him, but you know, he spent the time with me wishing me the best of luck and giving me some advice and some pointers and um, yeah, it just it was it was special and, and I think a lot of those English players at, at that time as well were you know went off to, to, to win a World Cup soon after that and um, they were a special team and, and to, to be in, in the same environment let alone the same squad as them was, was massive, really exciting and uh, it was just tough to be there really. Oh, I don't know. I think the first step, fantasy, was just because it took me a couple of years. My first tour was '98 um, with Ireland, and uh, I would have been young enough. I just started playing with Gary on at that stage. Um, I hadn't played for Munster. I'd only played with Gary on, and, and, I, and uh, sorry, in '97 I'd only played with Gary on, and in '98 I, I, you know, I played a couple of games for Munster, but but not really. So uh, in the back of your mind, uh, it, it seems like a long way away, um, especially when. Those early years, you weren't making the monster team, Europe, and that. You, you, you kind of put your kind of walk before you can run. But um, I think once, once I think I did a bit of that goal setting session. You, you, uh, you, it becomes a bit more realistic when you when you have it in the back of your mind that maybe someday I right, play for Monster, play for Ireland, and then the, the next step is logically the, the Lions. But you never know if you're going to do it. But you got to set that goal. I suppose 2009 hurt uh, I th uh, because you know I, I've been there for the whole tour. Uh, you really feel part of it. You're you're in the you're in the test team, and uh, my brother had gone before me. Had won down there, and he was always going to be slagging me after it, and, and really does. But yeah, no. On, on a serious note, it, it was it was tough. I mean, that second test was was tough to wake, uh, walk away from. Um, we'd given it our all. I mean, it was it was an incredible battle, and and uh, you know everyone left left everything out there. Um, and to come so close, um, it was tough. And we, we turned around the last test, but you know, I suppose the series was over at that stage. Um, it was it was emotional. They always are because they're at a special point in time, one that you'll never be in that room with the, those players again, and uh, never be in that situation. And um, you know, it, it, for a lot of guys, and you know, for me especially, it was it's just a pinnacle of, of your career, I think. And yeah, 2001, I suppose, was slightly different in that you know, I got called up late, but. Um, it was still still emotional. You know, the guys. You, you, I was nearly called in at one stage when Scott Connell um, in the second test pulled up with a, with a knee injury the, the night before the game. So um, I was kind of nearly nearly going on warming up with the team. Um, so yeah, and it, it's it's still you know no matter how long you're there, I think you, you quickly become part of it because it's a special environment and, and it's very welcoming. I think and the players make make uh, a point of doing that. Mm -hmm.